don't close your eyes, you ain't blind. I'm trying to have the hoop and smoke blind. She be playing too much. See a shot, take a shot. And while we do that, you know where you came. You know where you at. And you know and what you, you need to do. And you know what you, you need, need to do. You need to like. Uh-huh. You need to share. Let's go. You need to comment. For sure. And then you need to subscribe. All right. And after you've done all of those things, right, because mm -hmm. it don't take that long, you're going to hit that little ding, ding, ding. In the, in the, right there. The Just like your right ring now. doorbell when your DoorDash person come, you try to act like you ain't hear them. Right. Yeah. Right. Beep. You know it. <laughs> hit that ding. For sure. Because. Shout out to DoorDash. We here for you, too. Fuck. Well, yeah, we like this count. <laughs> it would, it wouldn't be. A, but, but but wait, <laughs> I can't even get the introduction right because. Matter of fact, hold on. Before we introduce the show, yeah. Let me introduce Bob. Baby, is the Bob for me? Swish. That's when you swish. So bitch, what? Yes. Smack What'd that hoe. Flop. Don't play with me, bitch. Who drank ain't work? Who? Who we? Where? You said yeah. jump. Bitch, I bitch. And then watch it, watch it go back in formation. Ooh, just like that. Just like Don't that. Don't make me sweat up. Let me press press out. Yeah. Shout out to Erica with the Dominicans. P period. Shout out to Erica at Sulu's Voodoo's <laughs> Shoe Shoes. <laughs> and Tucker. And Tucker, I'm going to get the right name and give y'all the right credit. We're going to have it. We're going to have location data. We're going to put it in the comments. We're going to drop the location Shout out to Erica <laughs> at Sulu's. Because Erica, you did your thing because no flex. She did. She did no that. flex. I'm about to kill my I, I love to cut my hair, but I be so scared to cut my hair. Oh, and yeah. Oh, y'all, wait. Y'all know where we at. This is the Keep It 100 Talk Show podcast. The best, your favorite duo. Your favorite everything. And this is Southside 100. The neighbor with all the flavor. And you already know it's your girl, Kelly Cash. And that's Cash Day with a K. Because I like it my way. All day, every day. Baby, baby, baby. And today we have a special guest in our Girls Talk Edition. We got my homegirl, my crew member. You feel me? Easy E. Easy E Teddy for what's up? I hate that name. But hey, yeah. why, you hate, why you hate that name, Easy E? Easy E. Out of all fucking names. The, the, what, I take Ebony after that shit. Oh, that's yeah. I because got last week when you had that short wig on, you and was, you was really, it off, so you was real, because she was, no, okay, first boom. of all, she had, my first of all, look, she had, look, hold look, on, look. she had the short, let me, she, yeah, bring up a picture, yeah, all yeah. last week, we was reciting players' pub lines, she talking about, that's what she said, you could have gave me Ebony, she was really giving me, uh-uh, I, mean, I, no I wasn't, I wasn't finna go with them, no diamonds. Nah, bitch. Nah, yeah. uh, nah. You know what? This Matter of fact, we know. Because, because hey, my son was cute with the short cut. I'm sexy as fuck. 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 I'm sexy no, she she really she really gave me plans. Hey y'all, and y'all know we stream big alive, so you know get at your girl. Period. And shout out to motherfucking Raglo oh, Good just... Five. He done sucked us beans, girl. We got okay. Beans, shout beans, out to Raglo. Ah, 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 ah. ah. Period. Period. Yeah. Oh, you know what? My little thing that came out. We can't be doing this on the Christmas this week. Yeah, I always got a blooper, so that's our first blooper of the night. What's the hookah? What you talking about? You sorry, at home. Oh no, that. that. So I'm just saying, oh, like, would you be a stripper in your next life? I was a stripper. Oh, you were? Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, my bad. I was shaking my, my ass. ass. So why you won't shake no ass on camera? If you were shaking that ass for them folks, you could shake that ass for me, bitch. The fuck wrong with you? The fuck? You know, because because that's the type of party we be having. We saw you say, "Show, show the crew what you got." Show the crew what you got. You ain't even got to see what you got. Just say that. You know, let me see what you got. Just say that. Has anyone else, you know, been a dancer in their former life? I have. I used to tap dance like ballet and shit in my drink. I still tap dance I like ballet and shit. Uh, hey, talk about. 
for the right price. So get at your girl. My DMs are open for booking. Period. Yeah. The fuck? You heard that. You heard that loud and clear. Like, period. No, but here. the market, like, okay, make it clear. We are, we are, you know, I thought them heels on if we got to, but the market is Mine's nowhere the near. The market is nowhere near what it used to be. Like, mm-hmm. I remember, like, be cheap and broke. And I know I got y'all Hell, about, heavy on the cheap and broke. I got y'all about, you know, five years plus. But, you know, and I know I'm big sis to y'all. I want but you to stop real. doing that. When, what you stop, mean? Stop doing that. No, because I, in the subject that we're talking, see, you made me hit myself with hookah. In the subject that we're talking, <laughs> bitch, y'all miss the real money fucking dancing. So it's yeah. like, I believe it. Any mm. any of our viewers who know when it was real money out there dancing, go know my, go know what's up anyway. So I know, feel like I ain't trying to put it out there. Magic it. City, I motherfucking Onyx. Um, what's another popular one? Flame, Flame. Hello. Them bitches give me, and they know pole shit. I ain't even know pole shit like that. I do little twists and turns and shit like so that. So what? Like, what? How, okay. What makes you think? A motherfucker really get money if they not on the pole. You just you just think like shit. Have a BBL, you know. A lot of clubs they sell like BBLs, big ass booty and the motherfucking titties and shit. Cause that's yeah, that's you know, the that's thing going the on. The the look, like, that, that's the stereotype. Look, no, honestly, cause we didn't even had this discussion at work. BBLs. Like, once you get a BBL, you, like, open doors for the rich niggas. Because that's what the shit... Because social media play a big part on the BBL, like, community type shit. You know how they go on social media? But you feel like in order to be the rich niggas, you have to have a BBL. In my opinion. I mean, of course, know how to dance and witty. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But, but, so okay, do you so think you got to be, like, soft and look right? Or do it just be, like, any BBL is just... No, that's any BBL. It has so like you done, later. You done seen any BBL? It be gone. Mm-mm, not any. It has to be like because I ain't gonna like hold BB, you. Like Jada Wada, who else got Asia doll? Asia, but okay. She, so you got Asia doll. Ew. Right. Like First of all, she didn't get shit that matched her motherfucking booty. She got. She just got yeah. booty, and that's it. Yeah. Jada Wada. Jada just said she just got ass shots. But do you still consider that a BBL? That like, even though it's not know. technically the surgery, you feel me? You don't think it's a big deal? I think no. it is. She said she got, she got no titties. The old Jada White, she was skinny. See, BBL ain't got nothing to do with titties. But Everybody know my baby. baby. Get that titties out. You know, that baby yeah, shit do fluctuate your weight. And then if she did get the ass, the ass shots she, and fucking. And then when you get some good dick. Yeah, all, yeah. all ugly niggas got good dick. I'm sorry. Yeah, like, if, 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 <laughs> God, if, like, that's one thing God gave ugly niggas. Like, now it's, yeah, it's a yeah. percentage of cute niggas with, with good dick. That just be just percentage. Uh, like you find a nigga but the majority of you cute, cute niggas out there are dead ass. Y'all y'all I'm y'all don't, don't got good dick. Like like all of the cute ass niggas that you think y'all's not shit in the bedroom. But every ugly nigga I know, yeah, I probably done seen your dick. Probably done gave you some coochie. But every ugly nigga that I know. Except for that one ugly ass nigga, the ugly ass nigga. So it's a couple of ugly niggas to the exception. It's that one. It's always it's that one Uno. The it's <laughs> always that Uno. That always that one. You get what I'm saying? And, and clip that. Kill. <laughs> but, um, yeah. I ain't finna play with you. <laughs> but, um, yeah. It, yeah. Yeah. Ugly niggas got, they come with. Yeah, the first with the ugly nigga, I thought he had a big ass dick. Y'all did. He was ugly. Uh, yeah, I, I couldn't I even like. He's got a big dick. So you just, he had, to get, you, had, he, he had to fuck on the back, huh? He had to. He he had had to. I couldn't. Bitch, all my baby. And at second. Did you suck it? Tell the truth. I didn't suck him. You no, couldn't? I didn't. I didn't. Not even with the lights on? Nah, I couldn't do it. Have mm-hmm. you ever had sex with an uncircumcised dick? Yes. How you I was feel? in college. It was like no, no, absolutely not. Cause it looks nasty. Like it does. 
And it's childish. Like, why did your mama not my my, my she baby? Said it's childish. Fucking your suicide. mom didn't love you. I feel like if your mom didn't circumcise you, your mom didn't love you. She, she didn't she, love you. <laughs> she couldn't. Have. <laughs> she she didn't give, give a fuck. fuck. She didn't. She didn't give a damn if you had kids. And she get all stuck in there and shit. And like, you had to clean um, that shit. You dirty. You kill cute shit, bitch. You gotta got man. You gotta and you clean know, that shit. And you know niggas already don't wipe good, <sighs> so you know. Girl. Uncircumcised niggas got to wipe two times. <laughs> so, so, they got to wipe twice. They got to jiggle and wipe. And, and wipe. Picture so, you know, shit. matter of fact, I, I need some opinions from the uncircumcised no, niggas out here. The yes, I do. Go. Yes, I do. I need y'all in the comments. Get circumcised. That's what you do. Be grown. Can go you, ma- can yes, you, you can. can. Yes, you can. It hurts like a fuck, but stop being a fucking No, I'm serious. Stop being can, a bitch. Can, can niggas yes, do that as an adult? Can. Yes. I didn't even know that. Didn't it's it? a yeah. surgery that they can go under. Yes. Uh, mm. Yes. It hurts, but it'll feel mm. better. When you so do what you gotta do. Imagine getting an uncircumcised dick pic. But Mama, you wouldn't. Let me tell you something. You wouldn't know. You wouldn't know. Because most niggas who uncircumcised, they know that. So they gonna pull it back anyway. Half mm-hmm. the time, they hard. I ain't gonna bullshit you. I wouldn't lie to you. You know that. I'm trying to think. Of, have I ever gotten an uncircumcised? How would you know? And no, no, no. I did ass think I got one. Pull it up then. Pull, pull it up to add some, add some to it. Add, add some to that. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Yeah, pull, yeah. This is this is. You know how in, in the friend group you got you got the whole friend, you got the alky friend. You got the lame friend, the, the sober one, but the one who just keep y'all together and shit. Man, what's the other? What's the other two? Cause it's it's about five. You got the hoe. You got the. You I got don't know. The messy friend. Oh yep. You I got you got, you got the you just, got the messy friend. Got you got the messy friend. The whole friend, but that yeah, that qualifies like fucking your man type shit. Yeah, that's the whole friend. Yeah, that See, that's the thing. I don't like hanging out with bitches like that because I beat your ass. Because like it's a real, it's like a that. real thin line of where the fuck I draw the line, and that's where the fuck I draw the line, bitch. I smack the shit out you. And you know what? Something that you sent to me or you posted that I really thought about, bitch. When is our friend anniversary? This is a long ass time ago. I get you though, cause not everybody. Me personally, I can't hang with a lot of females because I'm so vocal and blunt, and sometimes we rub people the wrong way. So sometimes I have to keep to. Stay. You know what I'm saying? She know our job. Our job. Girl, I know about your job. Uh, she. I knew about your job before. Before before we knew about our job. I told her not to go to the job. She went anyway. I don't know why I say that. I'm here. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, okay. Question. Pop up question. And both would get it. You probably going to get it first. But I don't know. Would you fuck a bitch man? Who just thinks she? Who who just yep. thinks she just? Yeah. Got got her got her got her nigga on yoke. Mhm. No. Would you fuck her man just mm-hmm. to prove just to prove that bitch like bitch? I'm telling you, he just a nigga like the rest I'm of these niggas. I've done it. Mm-mm. I'm done it. No. I don't care. You, you know, ain't my friend. I don't owe you no loyalty. You said my friend? No, a bitch. Oh yeah, absolutely, bitch. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. And so, yeah. So, so that's the whole, so that so yeah. Absolutely. That's the whole, that's the whole plot. Yeah. It's going to be hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, uh, you know, it's hashtag one for the team. <laughs> you need for everybody. For sure, that's true. But don't hit my line. Asking why my number ain't your nigga shit. You wasting your time. You probably should have asked that, <laughs> that nigga. nigga bitch. You probably wasn't fucking that nigga. You probably should have. I mean, all, how the fuck am I supposed to know? I mean, you said that he was your nigga, right? Right. Cuffing is dead. You heard what I said? Bitch, cuffing my is dead. Is a bitch coming These little niggas don't know how to act. Right. They in and out of everybody. Never trust no nigga, bitch. 
all these niggas counterfeit. Mm-hmm. Baby girl, when you gonna learn? That's that not your nigga, nigga shit. Fuck. <laughs> 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 these niggas for everybody. I don't like how girls call <laughs> you trying to like get confirmation on you fucking the nigga. Like, I'm gonna tell you every time. I, call your nigga. Click. Okay. But have y'all called the girl before? Fuck no. For what? Now I'm not calling the bitch. I have. Oh, wait. And here's why I have. Bitch, you know about me. I'ma call you. Cause I feel like it's personal. What's up? Because you knew about Cause me. you know me. Yeah. Now if this was just a little mm, no. But bitch, you know me. I spent Thanksgiving oh, and Christmas and Easter and Halloween and Hanukkah too, bitch. Mm-hmm. And New yeah. Year's. Right. You know me. Definitely. Okay. Very so, well. so on the flip family side. with Nana on the couch, <laughs> cheesy uh-huh. bitch. Yes. The fuck you know me <laughs> holding the grandbaby. Hello. Okay. So on say the flip cheese, note, Marvin. I'm pretty sure we all ain't got that phone call. Definitely. Do you I, tell on a nigga? No. It depends on how good the dick is. Good, great answer. Because mm. if that dick good, that why you on my phone? Girl, I don't, that I don't boy, he's my friend. Like that, that he cut here. Exactly. Like, he did my son dread. <laughs> son ain't got a dread. The bitch tried to convince me she was the girlfriend. I was like, how? <laughs> <laughs> a bitch tried to convince she what? You kind of convinced me like she was the girlfriend. I'm like, for sure. Where would you at? Like, but you know why? Because that's. The, because the, that's mm-hmm. the position that these niggas be giving. They bitches. too. They be too. No, me they personally, is as backwards as it sounds, because like I always preach, I feel like a nigga gonna do it anyway. Mm-hmm. Right. I don't. I don't mind. Like I'm the king of open relationships. Niggas just don't want to have one with me. But I am willing to be in an open relationship. Let you do your motherfucking thing and keep your hoes in place, but that's the difference between now and then. But see, certain these niggas, hoes don't know how to stay in place, and these niggas don't keep their hoes in place. Yes, like these definitely. niggas, and I know for a fact from both ends <clears throat> because it's some niggas that I know for a fact. It's some niggas in my life. That I, you you could have been with your. It, it could have been a new bitch, an old bitch, or, or, or whatever. It don't fucking matter. Mm-hmm. I come around. I don't even have to try to fuck your shit up. I come around. It's you gonna stop what you're doing for me. Not mm-hmm. saying that you feel me. That's what I want. But I know it's niggas like that. Sure. So niggas just don't give me me the privilege of having an open relationship. But I always put it out there like that. But I'd rather do that because I feel like don't a nigga do it. Do no, do they want to do it, but they want you to do it. Oh, no. The thing about it is, oh, I ain't gonna lie to you. I cheated in peace. Yeah. I never cheated. You never would? I thought about it. I never cheated. You been I faithful, y'all. Yeah. I should have lied. I thought about should've it. I should have cheated. Baby, I should have went out to the club. I should have. Oh, baby, I should have <laughs> done it. Should have <laughs> given away all my love. What? <laughs> baby, I. I should have played you. <laughs> you talk about she. You do you know what you're missing out on? Hello, <laughs> hello. Feels great out here. Feels great outside. Not anymore. Yeah. I see why my nigga didn't want me outside. Not These niggas not. love me out here. These niggas love, love me. me. <laughs> but no, seriously, put put that on life. You've never, daddy. you've never. Oh my daddy, I know. I am. She, she's part of the what? The point five percent, not mm-hmm. even the one percent. The point three. That's a, that's she, proof that black women don't cheat. Black women don't cheat. We're just mixed. <laughs> Fuck it. But pure black women, they don't cheat. They don't cheat. But I never. I they never don't cheat. cheat. My grandmama didn't cheat. Now my great mom, my great grandmama, she probably has you hear them. Mm-hmm. But my grandmama didn't <laughs> cheat. But I am okay. So even when. You found out a nigga was cheating on you. Not once left. did you ever. Okay, that's great that you just left. But not once did you just ever want to get some get back. You ain't never got I, your lick back. You ain't never got your lick back. My lick back is me, bitch. The fuck I'm leaving. The fuck I am the lick back. The fuck you okay. talking about? Without me, bitch, you're you you're a bum. Like you're nothing. But why did he cheat? Why did he cheat? 
Mm. You know what? Mm. Or why do you feel okay? Why do I feel like and, you and, know? And niggas one or, example that. And, and one example. Um, of I felt example. like I wasn't too like I would say feminine. When I mean feminine, I wasn't too like a clingy you just, and yeah, you just walk around and just like yeah. I gave nigga vibes. Too much. Okay. I never blew up a nigga for oh wait you didn't call me back. I don't do shit like that. I'm you like, know that's you why uh, that nigga Vanessa two times broke up with Erica Banks. He said she gave nigga vibes and he was like nigga I ain't trying to come home to my nigga I want my bitch. And he was like which is understandable yeah. but it's just like I try to like get them to understand like you know my daddy he wasn't really like I wasn't brought up with all that. My love was nigga I'm loyal I make sure I'm here for you you know what I'm saying I got you you know what I'm saying yeah. I'm, you know I'm be there for you no matter what type shit you know I'm fuck you all that shit but the other flip side like they wanted me to be all like taking pictures on and shit i like take pictures but i ain't pressed on it like we yeah. don't we don't got no taking pictures and shit. We, yeah the nigga I'm not, it's, you know, it ain't necessary because so you felt like the nigga made made me want it more affection right at least that that, that was an excuse or whatever but in my book i felt like i was but hey whatever i feel like that was an excuse and my baby daddy he's just a hoe so that he just he a hoe lame ass nigga I hope he follow you, bitch. Oh. Send my money. Send my money heard. to my motherfucking brother. You heard that. Bum ass nigga. You heard that. Send her, send her chonies to send her people. Send the funds, bitch. Okay, and get tested. Oh. Mm. Cause he bitch, he fuck anybody. See, a nigga dangerous if he just fuck anybody. Like, just any, you have no, you don't have no type. Bad yeah, bitches bad. is the only thing that I like. You don't have no time. Um, niggas scare me when they don't have a type. Like, for real. No, you got a point. You got a point. They scare me. Like, like if you, a nigga don't have, you have no standards. Don't. But I, I don't feel... When it come to coochie, I do feel like don't know. Because I'm picky about my dick. You got Now, as far as a nigga wanna, who, like, want to come home to a bitch, I feel like, yeah, nigga got a type. But as far as just coochie, I feel like... It could be a sober night. Mm-hmm. So, bitch, if a good nigga, I'll bring some coochie. I would. No, I. Cause I'm an ugly, ugly nigga with some money, I will. Fuck, sure. hello. I hop on it quick. Coochie get wet. See, I, 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 I my shit get dry. Okay. Yeah, they stand you with that money. It's the cute niggas that stand you. Like, nigga, I would go get the ugly nigga down the street, your friend. The cute niggas be wanting you to fuck three times, go out to dinner, meet their mama, and all the other ugly shit. It ain't nothing wrong. Ain't the nothing ugly wrong niggas be like, I'm going to hurry up and do what I got to do because this bitch is going to realize I'm ugly soon. But, right. but when your coochie good, good, you get that treatment from both the sides. The thing about it is, mm-hmm. when your coochie that good, I don't want a nigga. I want to be the nigga mama, like that, for real. Because mama's is fake. Because no I'm going to be fake as fuck, too. But I don't want to be. I don't want to Ooh, be a son. nigga's mama no more. This shit. Lord have mercy. I don't. I'm Brandon with the rest of my house. My baby, you're not alone. I don't, I don't think I've you. met one. No, I ain't gonna hold you. I don't want no I've met one semi-real mama. You know what I'm saying? But other than that one, yeah, I ain't met one real mama like that's mm-hmm. double-sided mm-hmm. yet. Mm-hmm. Except for just this one. I, I have. Know. Soon shit go little, they yeah. take these sons side. I ain't got time for I have. She was willing to let the whole move in and everything while I was staying there. Bitch, I smack this hair every time I wake up. No, I'm talking about real, like, that's going to keep it. Oh, wait. That's going to keep it, like, real with you. Like, fuck this bum I'm telling you, I was living with the man in the family. I'm telling you, you were willing to bring the bitch and let the whole live in the same home. I think that I remember that. I think I remember This is the same hoe from the woods. I think I remember Yeah. yeah. And I said, every time I wake up and go to the bathroom, I was smacking her while her sleep. She can come. Sip, sip. She can come. Hold on, my husband's face. Yeah. I just... I, I, I'm not with the me, the mama shit. The mama straight. I don't want to meet your mama. Like, I re- I'm really not in gung ho on me and the motherfucking family like that. No more. Like, and I don't be all over the mama face either. Like, mm-hmm. I'm, I'm ch- chilling, do some drink, I'm drinking. Like, I don't even too pressed to even. Mm-mm. You know how, like, some bitches be like, 
in the mama face trying to be like I never cared to yeah. be. I never cared to be. Me neither, like, no, but no, the no. mamas always always have like flocked to me type shit. And yeah. I was just like Right. I bet like oh. Yeah, yeah I, I remember bet. you called me from the Home Depot. Girl. She said, sister. What the fuck? Story time. Let me tell you. What y'all you gonna do? Let me tell y'all. <laughs> let me tell y'all about a nigga mama. Lord have mercy. Story time. So <laughs> boom. <laughs> so I was washing my clothes at this nigga mama house. And you know, it just so happened on my particular wash, your wash machine stopped working. Mind you. Wash machine could have been on his last motherfucking leg, but on my particular wash. Mm-hmm. Wash machine stop. Damn. So I'm just a real individual. Damn. You know. <laughs> right, let's keep going. I'm just a I'm just a real one. <laughs> like, you know, I'll get your wash machine fixed, you know, whatever. Whatever. It was I don't know what was wrong with your shit or why it stopped, but I got you. I get it fixed or whatever. So one day, she asked me one day, like, you ever me somewhere? I was like, just get out. I'm like, cool. So we ride to this Home Depot. Mm-hmm. Okay. So we in the Home Depot. Chill. I don't roll with you, you know. Mm-hmm. We in the Home Depot. She looking at washing machines and stuff. Cool. And as she's looking at washing machines, she asked me, how this one? You know, you like this one, blah, 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 woo I'm like, shit, you know, I'm saying, washing machine, whatever's fitted for you, you know, woo-doo-woo. Whatever wash the best. Boom, yeah, whatever, that's, that's, that, that's in my head, bitch, whatever wash the best, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, she find one that she likes, mm-hmm. and and goes like, I think her last question to me was like, you think I should get a warranty on this? And I was like, I mean... Shit, how you left one went out, you might need to. You feel me? Like, you know, I don't know. So we get to the register, the lady rings up the, you know, the wash machine and the warranty. So I, I mean, all the way down to putting in the address to like the shipping, like where, you, where the wash machine going. Yeah. So it goes to pay. You know, I, I don't even know the fucking amount, but I know it was at the point to pay, you know. Right. So when the lady says the amount or whatnot, do you know? Do you know this lady gonna turn to me like, what's up? Yeah. yeah. Bitch, I'm confused. You, you see the look on your face? Y'all caught that. Pan in on that. Zoom in on that. Yeah, I had that same exact look like. Bitch, huh? And that same exact so I go, I go, hold on. In all emergency situations, I called three people. Q, my mama. <laughs> And this motherfucker right here. Depending on the situation, it depends on who gets who gets the call first. Right. I go. That's my call. Give me a second. Hold on. I don't know if she thought I was calling my bank, checking my card or whatever. Yeah, I moved to the next aisle. Bitch, pick up the phone. I said, bitch. Pick me up, bitch. <laughs> get up. Get up right now. I'm in the bed. I said, bro. bro this me, this me, this me, this me. Go ahead. You ready? This yeah. me right here. Right? This me. I'm like, hello. So. Do you know? You see where I'm at, right? Do you know this bitch got me at Home Depot and I done ran through the whole spit? She done looked at what she said, bitch. She had the worst. Bitch, you have the right. And told me to make bro. No, 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 this me. Bitch, you better leave. Bro, I'm not. I'm not. Bro, I am not. I am not. I'm paying for that. She better leave. When I say I was so, come home with me if I'm. I was so appalled. Like I was appalled, bro. I was like, "Bitch, it's the audacity! Like, why did you think that?" And I'm like, "Bitch, what's that's, that's that the the what you said? The audacity. It, that part. That's what the fuck I was trying to figure. Out. Mm. It's bitch, the you better leave. But, but bitch, you better leave. But bitch, I'm going on. Now, and you know, we just keep keeping it real. This is the keeping it one hundred talk show. We keeping it real in the same. Mm-hmm. I don't know if y'all y'all ever have, you know, been in a situation. Like not like that with the washing machine, but having to stay with a nigga and his mom. Mm-mm, I have to. Shit like that. I will never ever do that shit again. Ever. I don't give a damn if I have to be 
in the back of a car before I stay. I be in my trunk at a nigga mama house. Mm-hmm. Be in my trunk because one thing about that, the mama end up expecting more than goddamn. The, the, your your yes, nigga you know, end up yes, expecting. You, know, you pay for groceries. Hello, baby. Using the milk stamps for kids. <laughs> Yeah, kids Bro, they, they next thing you know, they ask you for your food stamp card and shit, taking you to Home Depot to pick out washing machines that they expect you to pay for, bro. They fuck like, wrong in this group. They want to pick your ass out. Mm-mm. Yeah, yeah. I'm not going for. She gonna let her sell us bro, out. Bro, and, go. and you know we all go through shit in life, and I'm not, you know, I'm not ashamed to say, but baby, when I say that will never. That will never happen again because, like, the mama feel entitled to some shit. She, some people, like, some people like the whole shit over your head, like, oh shit, you fucked up, da da da, you need me type shit. I don't like that shit. Like, don't, don't, cause just cause I'm in this situation and shit, don't use me to get what you want, and then soon shit get back. You know See, what, what? But what's so crazy? That shit only added fuel to my fire. Like, for example, before I moved. That was my situation before I got into, you know, my blessed right. situation. Right. So, but before I moved, I had got me another truck. Mm-hmm. Got, you know, pulled up a lot with a Range Rover. So, I come home in the Range Rover and shit, blah, 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 blah you know, bam, look what I pulled off the lot with, this and that, blah, 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 blah. Do you know, the first thing this lady said, and this was fuel to my fire, the first thing she said to me was, no congratulations, no. Oh, it's nice. No, it's I like the first thing that came out of her mouth was. No, she did say it's nice. She said it's nice, but look where you stay at though. Like, bitch, you got a Range Rover, but you stay in my house. When I say I, you, you can ask my sister, you can ask God. I will go on the next month on the first. I probably got my truck in the middle of the, it. It was probably two weeks. I was gone the next month on the first flight, baby. I'm going to show you. And I remember, I called I my I could show you, but I can see you. I called my sister and told her that. And I said, I'm finna be an asshole. I took, now, I have a habit of writing, like, things on sticky notes and putting them around my room or my mirrors on my windows. It's just something that I do. Mm-hmm. I took, I bought some sticky notes that day, and I put one word on each sticky note in the sentence that said, Look where you stay at, though. And I woke up and I seen that shit every day. And I said, I promise you, I won't be in this motherfucker long. And then the very next month, I was like, oh, this, this, you know, it's your last little rent payment. You feel me? I, like, oh, where you, where, where you, mom? Buckhead. Oh, it's high out there. I got it. Mm-hmm. I got it. <laughs> You mm-hmm. take it? No. And it's funny because, like, the same people <laughs> that be, no. like, no. doing that shit be needing you in the future. Oh, God. But what's so crazy? Popped all that. And when I left, because, mind you, I was still beneficial. I was still beneficial to you. Because, like, I'm an adult. You an adult. I ain't no lady, though. You feel me? But when I left, you just replaced my income with another roommate style income. So it was still, like, don't kick it like niggas just need it. Mm-hmm. Needed this shit, but nah, motherfuckers, it really do you like that, like so. Cause please believe, mark, mark our words. September twenty twenty three. Yeah. Cat, 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 cat. Gonna be pulling up in that beat G thing, that beat G thing like that right there with the dolls off. Mm-hmm. Watch, watch. My heat gonna always be on period. Cause I'm gonna need it. But who gives a fuck? Uh, period. Bye. I'm back in. I never liked the Jeeps. You know, I like the Jeeps as like, and here's my era again. Like when Clueless first came out, the movie Clueless. Uh-huh. It, that, and then Moesha. Moesha, her first car was a, her first car was a Jeep. It was. It, her, remember when her daddy was trying to get her a brand new that year Saturn or whatever, and she, and he and she said no, I want this Jeep. It could be ten years old. It could be whatever, but that's what she wanted. Yeah. But I don't know. It's like when you grew up on Barbies and shit. Like the Barbie, even my Barbie had a Jeep. You feel me? My like, Barbie had a Jeep. Girls who grew up on Barbies. I don't like me. I don't like, like the brown. I don't like being like low brown type shit. I was like, you like the little Lambo hoes like shit. Yeah. 
That's my stop sign. Like Lexus, Mercedes type shit. That's my dream. I want Mercedes, if anything. That's like my dream. I like that little CF 450. Hint, hint, baby. The bitch be rose gold. Yeah. I can see in some shit like that. Mm hmm. Yeah, I love pink. <laughs> so. YSL. YSL, 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 YSL. Heard that boy Thug finna come home. That boy Gunna home. That boy Duke YSL home. That boy Slide Light home. But all you had to do was say that YSL was a game. That's all we had. That's all we had to say. We had to say nothing else. We just had to say YSL was a game. And it's not illegal to say for a group of people to be in no game. And that's all we had to say. But it's, it's still considered snitching. It's a conspiracy. I actually went to Lil' Key. In high I, you know what? Rest in peace, little key. But I seen the funniest shit talking about why everybody and why I said just ain't get together, just blame everything on little key. That's a look good, good, good idea. Like, you know, I would, <laughs> key did it because he that said he did. That would have been if everybody but, lawyers and cools. Yeah. That mean everybody pockets is different. But I don't know how to throw a lawyer that goat, though. That, but did y'all hear about that gay shit in the courtroom? How they brought out the cell phone evidence. Like things that was in his cell phone. They put it out and they put out that it was Thug and like three other niggas in the cell, butt ass naked. Yup. Jacking their pickle. That is bad too. And, do, and that would be. <laughs> that would be it. So that would, I lost, I glanced at it twice and I was like, I can't thug do that. Thug got a big one. <laughs> he said. Shout out to Thug. Who got the gas? Shout out to Thug. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Would you fuck a nigga if he was told you he was bisexual? Mm-hmm. No. My teeth might be black. It's not charcoal. It's Oreos. Fuck yeah. Let me get one. Um, honestly, I want to say yes because I'm a sexual liber- liberated person and I don't judge nobody. Mm-hmm. But the main reason why I would lean towards the no is because. I don't want to be out and you secretly looking at the nigga I'm secretly looking at too. You get what I'm saying? Like, so yes. now I got to worry about a nigga looking at niggas and bitches. Like, I already got to worry about the bitches. But now I got to worry about the niggas too. You just bring them all home together. No. It's just the automatic no for me. For you? I think one nigga I was fucking with was bisexual though because I put my finger in his ass. And I was like, you know what I'm saying? And he was liking that shit. He legs up and shit. I was like, ooh, you liking this shit. I feel so like are you sick. into the prostate shit? Like, to a nigga or me? To a nigga. Like, I mean, because like, do what? You, what do, as a, as a female, what do you. I'm trying to figure out what the fuck was you doing? Get off. I, what do you get off of sticking yeah, your finger in his butt? Yeah, I was sitting there putting my fingers in his ass, two fingers in his ass. He was loving that shit. Okay, yeah, so. I like that, though. What be going through? What be going through your head while you sucking a dick? Like when you be like, oh, that ain't turning you off. Like, let me stick my fingers in here. I mean, like, cause I be, I'm a pleaser. Like, so I'm a pleaser. And what's your sign again? Cancer. Mm -hmm. I'm a pleaser. So and I'm a freak. So I'm, you know, I'm nasty. Mm -hmm. I say that bitch. I'm nasty. You eat ass. Like, no, hell no, bitch. You play with ass, but you don't eat ass. I don't, you know, you gotta wash that motherfucker. So, yeah. But if you wash it real good, yeah. Mm, like, you know, it depends on the nigga for real. Like. Have you ever ate ass before? <laughs> you can oh tell you God. can play the fifth? Okay, so boom. So as you're Kinda eating. Anyway. <laughs> okay, so boom. Okay, you never so, reached the whole nother little glute area? Your little the like, gooch. The gooch. Oh yeah. Oh, okay, so the you'll gooch. you'll suck on the nigga gooch. I do tonight. Hey shot, you know. I so wanna like say put the camera on that camera. <laughs> 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 like, they said zoom so in. Man, you man, 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 man. 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 He, he drinking, I'm drinking. Hey, you wanna have a You know, you can call you another little shit, you know. Can I see the thing? Like fuck. No, but no, seriously. Like, like, turn on. I think about that guy. I need to drink. Oh, I think we gotta make some. Oh damn! Straight shots. Straight shots. <laughs> you don't need no more, bitch. <laughs> no, <laughs> okay, so it okay. Mm. 
I licked the glutes part. Like, I don't know if it should. Uh, you licked it or you sucked it? You, it was it. the tip or it was the whole tongue? The whole tongue? What you so, mean? So you. So you. Ah. Uh, you be y'all. You be. I'll be into it. Bitch, you're nasty. Be all, I sure am nasty. I'm not smoking with you. you I was trying to roll up too. All right. You stick your tongue in the butt? No, I never did that. But you will <laughs> lick the gooch. I will. You like girls? You I fuck the girl? I have. You, just, you ate her ass? No. I never ate no girl ass. But you don't do that, but you'll eat a nigga ass. I never ate nobody ass. But you got close to it. You stuck your tongue there. That don't count. It does. It does. Your mouth there. I never put my... And now, I never put my mouth Okay, So, it just licked the crack. I just... (laughs) The glutes. The glutes. The the ass. You got the ass. You got the balls. And that's the... Okay. I used to have an area pierced. Okay. What? (laughs) Yeah. It didn't hurt? Yeah, I had everything pierced, but yeah, oh, I, I have, I have, I, yeah, I, yeah, I used to, yeah, I used you to can pass me some juice, please, if yeah. you love your TT, cause yeah, but um, I guess I'm a virgin, cause bitch, I have it. never. Mm. Oh, oh, nah, nah. N- 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 but see, though, I ain't never did that either. I don't, I don't do that oh, shit. Oh, for sure, you I love me for real. I don't do that shit to every nigga. You so one how? Nigga. So only one nigga, nigga has gotten that that the yeah. goose treatment, and that's why, cause I felt like we was gonna be like forever type shit. But so, yeah. how do you feel now that oh. you done sucked on a nigga? Girl, ass I feel great because he ain't never gonna get that shit ever again. Now he might find another girl do that shit, but. Mm. That nigga still hit me up to this day, so I'll deal with he still ain't. If you suck my ass, I hit you up to this day too, cause I ain't gonna hold you. I got this that one, okay. this one much. Hot potato, hot potato, hot potato. You fuck a nigga brains out and do all types of shit, man. You are unforgettable. But the but the nigga still leave. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> but I left in that situation. I left. I was like, uh, you, you not, you, you just fucking anybody, bitch. Like, I, you know. So, and that's the point. It don't matter how good you fuck a nigga. You and can fuck is. a nigga ass. You can, you can I never suck, suck a ass. nigga, a nigga, nigga, nigga ass. ass. And, he never ass. and he still gonna cheat. And he still gonna cheat. Still gonna cheat. And he still gonna cheat. Why do niggas cheat? Cause I Cause. <laughs> That makes sense. What okay, what is what is cheating? See what is what is Fuck it, bitch. <coughs> why y'all together? Cause I'm cause that's the norm now. Like a nigga a nigga's gonna fuck the bitch. He, he gonna fuck the bitch. Period. Right. If you give him the opportunity, he gone. <laughs> Honestly, I'm at the point where if, if as long as a nigga ain't treating a bitch like me, I'm good. Whatever. Do your thing, boo I'm gonna do my thing. So too. it's cool for the nigga to cheat, but he dare not, not cheat the for for a nigga, no, he dare not cheat with a bitch that's like you, similar to you. Damn right. Don't be taking that bitch on dates and I haven't heard. Her oh, you talking about you want to see what's in the dark? It's okay. I don't give a fuck. Yeah, but he just can't take her out. Pop that. Sure. Like, cheat. The only cheating to me is spending money on the hoe. If you with me and you sp- like, cause even my nigga like doing all that extra shit. Fuck her. I don't give a. Cause but bitches when you now feel like, bitch, oh, you when you, you spend hour oh, money, when you take yeah. out an hour wallet and you put it in another bitch hand, like a bitch, I don't give a fuck what a bitch call my phone. Oh, I'm fucking that nigga, sucking that nigga dick. That don't mean Oh, I'm shit. doing all that shit. But when a bitch say, money? when if a bitch say he, can, I'm gonna crack, I'm gonna crack your motherfucker. Let a bitch say you, he paid he did anything. What? He he I'm, paid for who golden corral. Don't worry about. It. I'm, I'm, I'm all right. You do. <laughs> I'm gonna Barbara crack King. this motherfucking skull. You say he bought you lunch at work. He for did. Sure. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. That's a okay. full oh, 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 You said. Oh, yeah. For sure. Yeah. A biggie bag. <laughs> oh, he got you a large drink. A large oh, drink. A large. Okay. Okay. You okay. yeah, feel fancy that day. I'm gonna crack his motherfucking skull. I'm gonna be his ass. Don't Spending worry. money on a hoe is that's the. And on that note, bitch, where you at? Right. Cause how you get my number? That be the question. How did you get my number? Because hoes be knowing already. That's the thing. No, I already. I mean, you stopping your page. That bitch. Remember what that bitch? That bitch made twenty five fake pages. I blocked every one last one. Bitch, you're obsessed. A bitch made twenty five. She made twenty five. We already confirmed that she fucking any. I said, okay. Well, I guess you both could be fucking, huh? I guess. Okay. So who's well, matter of fact, who 
is this nigga? Because that nigga must got. What's my baby daddy. The same baby daddy just said was a That's a juicy story time right there. That's a juicy motherfucking story time. The same baby daddy that you said was a bum? Yeah. He's just a bum with good dick. Yeah. You still fucking? No. Oh. I got a man now, baby. I moved on. He did soon. Nah, you can have a man that's still fucking your baby daddy. Mm, I ain't fucking with that nigga. So you're not team fucking my baby daddy? Like, mm. it was done. It's done. What? No, it's done. Like, you know, it's done. You got kids? I have a kid. <laughs> yes, I got a kid. Like, don't add the S to it. Make a singular kid. Now, if they ain't gonna take care of his damn baby, baby and shit, yeah, maybe. But once the little dad shit start kicking in, just like, you know. Because that should really be mattering. How you do for the kid is how I do. I'm not turned on no more. Yeah. Like, I can't be turned yeah. on. Like, you're, you're a bum ass dad. Like, I'm not even, like. It be kind of, it be hard, it be different if he was taking care of his kid and okay, cool, da, 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 okay, you know, like, it's not in there, but like you're not doing neither one, like you're not a good man nor a good father. I can't fuck with you at all. I can't fuck with you. Because it's, like, it's like, I, I baby just baby mother, I just baby mama who we'll will see. fuck your baby daddy. He ain't doing shit for your kid. I'm judging you because why are you doing that? He's not doing I'm shit judging for your you. child. This is me judging you. You see this? I'm judging you. You're so, a bum too. So, if you started dating a dude mm-hmm. and he got kids... But you see him do for his kids. Mm-hmm. And, yeah, and it's like, they yeah, I love, look. Do you dub the dude out? Fuck no, the kids come first. No, 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 I'm saying, you see he don't take care of his oh, kids. Oh, no. I'm dubbing do it. You, you I'm dubbing it, no. Out. Kids always come first. I should not come first. Your kids come first. I come second. And it always should be like that. And I dated niggas with kids. If I, I feel like you're not being a good father to so your kids, I got, I'm going. Like, I'm going, and me as a mother, like, that's but when no. the mom shit. Can- what if you don't have kids and, um. And you're dating to do with kids? Yeah, and they don't do, do you feel like that's your, you know, your business, your situation, you don't care, or how would you go about that? If you don't have kids. Um, no, nah, it would still be the same, it would be the same, because I, like, the, the kids, kids come be, first. Because I would feel a way, different. you buy me something, and you know your kid need this and need that, you know what I'm saying? First of all, well, for me, I don't know, for me. I'm now, not, if by, by all means, to answer your question, should you include yourself in that baby mama and that baby daddy business? No. no. You, that ain't got nothing to do with That ain't got nothing to do with you. Yeah, but as well, far as taking care of the kid, yes, because you, no. you signed up for that. Okay. You signed up for that. Now, kids, you up now, that. to that extent, if you do not have kids, I and like that ain't got nothing to do with me. If you do not have kids and you choose to deal with a nigga who has kids, that's still his responsibility. You mm-hmm. do what you are, mm-hmm. what you feel comfortable with mm-hmm. doing. You feel me? Don't feel obligated because you fucking with yeah. a nigga with kids. Because yeah. these niggas be having six, four, five. 15 kids and would only tell you about two. Right. You yeah. feel what I'm saying? Only want mm-hmm. you to do for his two favorite. Nah, fuck it all, all that. Ends up you get what I'm saying? Like, no. Choices. It all yeah. ends up with choices. The motherfucker you choose to motherfucking. My baby, baby, for example, he got six kids. Bitch, I'm not signing up for that. What number are you? I'm four. Dang. So he still had two after you. See, the thing is, so when I met my baby, so, so he See, won. So, okay. Damn, look. he was still on the When road. I met him, he had three kids. Mind you, this wasn't no we finna be boyfriend girlfriend situation. We were just fucking. We were just having you having sex and shit like that. So it wasn't. It was never supposed Sneaky to be. Drinking. Basically, it was. This is around COVID time. We get a thousand dollar check every week. Hello. I would have number two time. Was, and I just right. got. Hello. I just getting paid. I just got out of relationship. Two year relationship. So I wasn't on no relationship. Shit. I just wanted to get me. And he had poor dick. So he had good dick. So I was like, oh shit. I, oh, I got happy. So I fucked every day. Da, da, da. <laughs> I got pregnant. That's what she <laughs> said. Yeah. At that point, yeah. I tell girls all the time, I wrote, I want females to get this shit out of their mind. Marriage or not, you can still be a single mother. People always say, marriage, marriage, yeah, marriage, talk, marriage. You, know, you know, still can be a, you can still be a single mom. I episode. hate, I, cause I see the shit on TV and it pisses me off. It's just like, well, I would wait till I get married for da, da, da. Yeah, whatever. Right. When you get married, it's the same thing. You your your whole, you your whole life changed. Yo, man, your husband, whoever is at work. Yeah, at home, baby. You're going to need a break. You're going to be tired. 
that's when chaos into your relationship or marriage get you know what I'm saying? It caused a problem. Might lead to a divorce. Now mm-hmm. you're a single mom. I'm just not Sorry. getting married to no nigga because I've been seeing It's about finding the right life. partner. Um, I just I just see that no. the right partner. Ours is taught by the best, baby. When I say our girls is gonna be so well prepared for anything in life, they're going to be prepared for anything. I'll never, I'll never get married. Well, okay. well, by all means, after I had my baby, whatever. Now, mind you, during the first year, I, I went through the bullshit. Oh, I don't want a man, I'm a nigga. Then you're not ready yet. I'm like, look, nigga, I ain't ready, but guess what? I'm gonna get ready. He has to be here. He biggest blessing ever. I don't, you know, I don't give a fuck. Yeah, I may struggle here and there, but I, okay. I don't never put that so, on so ever. Are you, and you could have just said that, such and that, but have y'all been, have y'all ever been the moms? Don't, don't have a bitch around my kids, that shit. Because I've always now, been Now, when I, my son, now, yeah, when so my much. son you was ask, first. You can ask my kids, I have never gave a fuck about a baby daddy bitch. They're, they're eight, they're the seven. The way, when you are. You want to keep Omi, you want me to call you Omi or Beverly, either one of the two. Like, you feel me? A, a, or, a or B, Marquita, Mar- Marquita, the mm-hmm. quick, 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 the, the kiki, that's it. All right, cool, for sure. Like, you Tell know. Lily, said, I said, I'm around the corner. No. Yeah, I'm around the corner. Hey, you talking about like that? You need some weed? Uh, don't I you say it three, five with the kids. What's yeah, up? With, with the kids. Right, exactly. Hey, you talking about, but I've never been. For free? I've never been that baby yeah, mama. Mama. That, Don't worry about it. This one on the house. I got that you. That was always like. And the main reason why, and not even not even no secret, but the main reason why I never hassled a motherfucker for real, because I knew I could fuck him at any time. Mm-hmm. Right. Like, you feel me? Mm-hmm. And I feel like the baby mamas that be hassling the motherfuckers, I kind of kind of like it that way because I feel like he ain't giving you no dick right now. You tripping. You get what I'm saying? But for a big to be too friendly... But anyway, for a bitch to be too motherfucking friendly, bitch, like you too calm, ho. You get what I'm saying? But not saying that that's always the case. You could just have a cool ass bitch. Like that's not true though, because cool see, mama. I'm a baby mama who I kick kick with you all day. I don't give a fuck who you with. Your hoe could be sitting right there with you. What's up, Sean? Until you disrespect me or my child, then uh, that's, me personally, that's when shit I never shit cared. Through. Who was around my child, but it's the way how my baby daddy did it. He did it in a sleazy way. He never yeah. let me know. I never. Okay. And see, that's why we always been beefing. Cause I'm like, nigga, I don't give a fuck who. Cause he wanted to fuck on me, but I, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, I didn't really want to fuck on him. I didn't want to deal with him. I just want to keep it as my child. Cause at the end of the way, like, we could be parents to this little boy. Like, you yeah, know but you made a point. It's how you present it. It's how you female, present it. Females will. I, as I, I will now. Present you can't shit. be around my child if you doing. The I first of all, he got a girlfriend. The bitch I I found out through her, not through him. To me, that was disrespectful. Cause I'm like. That's so, not your place to come tell me that you So, wait a minute. You been around my child. and Cool. You bought him shit. You, you never heard my child. Great. But why the fuck I'm not hearing about you? You been here. You been around my son for a year. That pissed me the fuck off. Damn, a whole year? That pissed me off. Yeah. Because I'm thinking you, you with his dad daddy. All time. But you were. You. You. Because the thing is, I know my baby daddy. See, when we was together, while he's at work, guess I was pregnant and watching his child. His little three-year-old. So, do you think his baby mama knew that you was watching his? Yes, kids? absolutely. Because I didn't. Even when I before I even came a mom, I always I'm all about respect. I'm very big on respect, and I fight about that shit. Anything. I'm big on fucking respect. Because at the end of the day, when shit gets respect, but I know how I get. Yeah. So I always tell him, Hey, do you do she know that I'm around her chat? Because it's, just, it's a certain shit she just don't motherfucking yeah. do. It's just common sense, bro. Like, come on now, like. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So when that shit happens to me, I'm like, bro, that's disrespectful. You, you know? Now I got issue with you getting your child because it's just like, bro, you can't even. Now mind you, when my child was first, my son's one years old. He been around three fucking females, mm-hmm. three. Mm-hmm. And there's too much shit going around the fucking world. Right. Motherfucker, leave. These bitches don't like me because they already knew that nigga was about this time was fucking me. So, so they didn't like me. So, uh, you, you so know what I'm saying? I can tell you. Would you? Wait. In knowing that the females don't like you, do you have do you have your kids around 
a bitch that don't like you. Even Fuck no. e- even if you know that her tensions are well with with if her tensions well, cool, you know, yeah, but whatever. It could be a mama you know, where bitch. You know the was... bitch don't like you. You still sending your kid over there? Mm-hmm. Me personally, fuck yeah. Cause bitch, you can get the fuck on. Or you can come see about me about your issue. Real okay. shit. Cause I'm that mom. I don't give a fuck. And I'm gonna tell you one time one time. I'm gonna, be with that I'm gonna tell you one time, one time only. I don't fuck with you. Whatever reason why I don't fuck with you, I don't fuck with you. Mm-hmm. Stay the fuck away from my kid. However y'all work it out. Y'all work, you feel me? Y'all work it out, but yeah, no. I'll and if it. you got that much static and chaos, bitch, that's simple. The one thing about it, all my daddy said, I I don't have to like you, but I will never disrespect you. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? To me, what she did, knowing that she, like, don't shit pop up in your mind. Like, maybe I should, did you tell your baby mom? Maybe she did have that conversation. I don't know. Mm-hmm. But for you to come and be like, oh, I've been running a child for a year. I've See, been clothes, with, da, 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 da. With me, Nobody been talking about, oh, no, she didn't. Like, what? What, See, what the with, fuck with, going on? With me, I know the intention of, I know females. I know females. I know females from a female Bitch, you be trying to be funny. I'm I not with that good shit when it comes to my child. I'm sorry. So I know whether or not, if me and the female get along, I know whether or not your intentions are good for my child or not. Mm-hmm. Like, for example. Shout out to my boy Q. Q. You know One thing about my baby daddy. That nigga had bitches. <laughs> that nigga had bitches when we went... Growing up, that nigga had, I can eat that, my dog. That nigga had bitches. So he had this one, you know, kind of ex love of his life, you know. Mm-hmm. Her being around my kids was cool. We might have static sometimes, you know, sometimes not. Sometimes we'll be on a good, good terms. But I've always known that whether me and, me and her good or whether him and, that, him and her good or whatever, she has always had pure intentions for my children. Now, I now back then I used to try to figure out why. You know, as years you know as years go by and you mature and you think back on certain things, certain reasons. I know why that has nothing to do with me or him. Just as a woman, you yeah. know, I understand. Um, but, but then again, you know, he had another little chick. Couldn't stand it. You know. And she would buy my kids shit out of spite. Like, you feel me? To piss. I know a female's intent. All yeah, that shit. Know. Thrown in the trash. Burnt, giving away. I don't give a fuck if it got tags on it. Whatever. Because I know your intent is not for my. You don't give a fuck about my kids, bitch. Exactly. He dicking you down real good. And you trying to prove a point to me, bitch. We got this. Right, you yeah. feel me? So, it's like. I know, I know, I know fact females. that his girlfriend that wouldn't have told me that she been right. He don't care about my son. Because why would you allow him to buy fresh kicks in my son? You know what I'm saying? Ain't got shit. I don't respect you as a mother. I don't respect you as a woman. Period. And don't, I don't. play. Yeah. I yeah. don't. I don't respect you. Shout out to Bigo. Uh, Especially if you're a mama. Yeah. Sorry. Especially your mama. How the fuck you a mama but you letting this nigga be a bum to my hmm. child? Okay, so did y'all see the video uh a dude had took the chick out on a date to Red Lobster. <laughs> <laughs> at the end of the date. <laughs> at the, at the, no, at the nah. end of the date. She wanted him to pay. She, she wanted, wanted him, him to take her baby daddy and her kids. To order damn near two full ass. I'm talking about not kids meal. Two full ass platters. Two full. She wanted to surf it to hold on. Wait, we use the right word. She wanted the damn. Um, <laughs> What's the most expensive shit? She wanted the ultimate feast. She didn't want the chicken tenders and fries and shit. She, I think the bitch ordered the ultimate feast and she ordered a steak dish. The nigga said, when I said the nigga went around the restaurant and pulled the mother, pulled motherfuckers like, look, man, excuse me, I need, I need your advice. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like I want to make sure I'm not tripping. <laughs> so, no, I'm sorry. first question, is it wrong to go out on a date with a nigga and just let's start there. Is it wrong to even just ask him to ask him I'm recording to ask him to get your kids to go play? 
Do you, and if that's the, and if you feel that that's not wrong, do you feel like that's some shit that you should have established before the date, like during like general conversation? Like you feel like I you feel like kid at home, blah, blah, when blah, you blah. have kids, it's a date. When you have kids, it's a red flag. Too. And you going out on a date and you single, right? Bitch, whatever the fuck you don't finish, get that shit to your kids. For real. That's not that man responsibility. You know it's not. And kid. it's a date. Like, y'all dating. Yeah. That's, like, that's key don't word. Dating. I don't now, think people know the. Like, I, I totally agree with you. Now, if I'm on a date, and during the date, and I'm really just trying to, you know, shout out to single mothers and shine this in a different light. If I'm on a date, and during the date, or even before the date, we've discussed, I, I've gotten a babysitter. Blase, blase. So, mm-hmm. You know, we just discuss home life and shit. Mm-hmm. And if the waiter comes over and I go, excuse me, can I get a separate order? And I order some. It don't matter what I order. Mm-hmm. Can I get a separate order? Blase, blase, this and that. To go, this and that. Now, if you offer to pay for the whole thing, mm-hmm. in in me knowing I've ordered something separately, to, I got this. I ain't need, I ain't asked you shit. I ain't whatever. I made it known, ma'am. Put this on a separate ticket, blah, because if I go, if I'm on a date with you in general, I mix. Now mind you, I'm gonna bring my own money to mm-hmm. to pop it on your ass if I have to. Mm-hmm. But if I'm on a date with a man, I'm expecting you to pay for this date. Period. Absolutely. Point black. Period. You dating, but, in, dating in Atlanta one on one. But if yeah. you so happen to when the checks, when the two checks come, and you say, "Man, I, you slide both," I, I got that. Then that's different. But you can't like you can't force a nigga to like. I ain't gonna hold you. I don't, if we done talked about that shit. I don't hear shit. You know, I don't. If a man you, ends you up used to go play recording. Time. If he end up recording you at the table, y'all been bickering about this shit for a long ass time, and he's had enough. <laughs> and he needs outside answers because the shit that you saying, it ain't adding up. Yeah, yeah. Niggas don't just pull out their phone and be like, "I'm gonna record this bitch." They gonna go back and forth with you for a minute before they say, "Yeah, somebody gotta see this shit." Mhm. Yeah. And then on even the- on my dude, I don't even expect him to even. You know what I'm saying? That's just shit. Yeah, I expect him to what? Expect him to. But this is I mean, your dude. Absolutely. But yeah, he, he do. Up. You my but, dude. But I, he do. I, if if I, I know you ain't got it for the for the moment, I got us. But if my dude dude is well and known and, and and where he's supposed, you got everything, baby. Period. Mm-hmm. You have everything. That's fine. Everything. 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 You have every everything. 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 Mm-hmm. everything. Every fucking thing, mm-hmm. all the way down to all the way down to my kids. Now, mind you, at the point where I'm at in life and like my kids' ages and shit, I don't require that. You right. feel me, of a nigga. But upon meeting me before anything, before the relationship progresses, I'm telling you, I come with such amount of kids. My kids come with me. Before you decide to, you feel me, pursue me or pursue a few or whatever the fuck, we can leave it at fucking and I won't even call, you see, but what niggas fail to realize or admit, they don't want to, they can't just fucking not call. Right. Bitches, we do that. We fucking not call. Like, we I'll fucking, fucking not call. call again. Like, niggas, like niggas is the one that, <laughs> like, you feel me. fuck. I'll let you call. I don't care if you got a girlfriend. I don't care like, if you got a girlfriend. Honestly, is, truthfully, if she ain't my friend, I don't give a fuck Sex you is just a physical thing. Like, you don't have to put, I don't put my feelings in sex. And to me, I, I don't. I'm that type. It I it, it depends on the nigga. The nigga. Like, if I know we, it, like, you know, I'm trying not to put my feelings like, and shit. And it come out anyway. And it just fucks me up. It, it like, it, it, and it can, it can be, I could be breaking the girl code. Mm-hmm. I could be breaking the code. And no, and no, I'm, and no, I'm breaking the motherfucking code. And no, I'm breaking the code. But sometimes, it be more than a D. I don't know what it be, and and, and God, you gotta take that look. You gotta take that out of the niggas or something. Like it. You feel? Because at the end of the day, once you realize, the first time, it really ain't not, more than the dick. It's really just the dick in that moment. 
when I had my first good dick, I caught feelings. But after that, I just trained my mind. Do y'all so remember y'all first good dick moment? Yeah. I caught feelings bad. I, I was hurt by that one. I was like, damn, you ain't fuck with me. The way you just told me you don't have no feelings towards me? Wow. Now, when I say, that's crazy. My first good dick moment was with my first baby daddy. And I ain't gonna hold you. I had fucked around and lied to the nigga about my age when we first started dating. So when we first started dating, I met him going, going 15. Like I was 14 going on 15. But I ain't gonna hold you. I lied to him and told him I was 16 at that age. I mean, so, <coughs> so, <coughs> and I was still a virgin at the time. Mm-hmm. So when it came to, you know, break my virginity or whatever, like, he broke it. It was a terrible experience. Terrible. That wasn't the moment I'm talking about. It was a terrible experience. So shortly after that, I think we was kicking it on the phone one day, and my birthday came. It was around my birthday. At this time, I was supposed to be, I was actually turning 16, but I was supposed to be turning 18 or something mm-hmm. like that. Yeah. So, <coughs> we keep we kicking it on the phone, <coughs> and... My mama pulled that old school, picked the other phone up type shit, hey man shit. Get Shanice, get out the phone. So I'm like, hey, man, man, I'm like, I'm out. It's him. Boom. He hit me with the, ain't you gonna turn 18? Like, the hell you want? It ain't with the whoop. So, long story short, I think my mama ended up calling it out one day. Like, this boy voice deep. You feel me? He got some old school mama. How old you is? This ain't no little boy. His voice right. too deep. How old you is? Do you know she? And caught your ass out. Do you know she? Yeah. And when I say, he hung up the phone. And probably for like two months straight. Now, mind you, I had turned 16 by then. Probably for like two months straight, he ain't talking. And, you know, that was my, he took my virginity. That was my first love. I was like, yeah, I was like, man, that, you know? So when he finally, finally picked up the phone one day and was like, you know, I was like, I'm going to have to put it on this nigga. Like, keep this nigga young, hot in the ass, 16. But I did my hair. I'm like, first love, I'm going to have to whatever. Now, my, our sex before that. I didn't know what I was doing. I, you feel me? And it hurt it. I was still kind of like getting over the virgin stage. Mm-hmm. But when I say that the first time I had sex after he realized, like, it, it, it took him a minute <coughs> to, you know, have sex. Because he was still over 18. So he's still like, bitch, I can still go to jail for you type shit. But, you know, grandma, grandma blessed the coochie down, a couple of family trees. And, you know, it is what it is. But yeah, home, you know, Bro, I had to double it. Boy, I had to double it. That time after that, that makeup, that makeup set right there, that makeup, <laughs> I had to double it. I had to double it. Damn. And the moral of the story of all that, he still cheated. Yeah. He still cheated. Gave a nigga virginity and all. You feel me? Doubled it and all. Gave you kids. He still cheated. My goodness, what you do? I realized that the nigga gave me good dick and I was in my feelings when I saw him at the basketball court. Knowing that I, I ain't had no business fucking with the nigga. Mm-hmm. And I tried to, hey babe. And he looked at me like. Damn. And it hurt your feelings. So I went home. She like, cried in the car. Bitch, she cried in the car. That bitch cried in the car. Right, bitch, I stopped like a baby. Like that a was baby. the last thing to make me tear up. Why that nigga don't love me? What the fuck? He just right. fucked me this morning. Now he's like, like, you bet, 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 I was out of high school, finna go to college. I don't say his name, Mike. 
<laughs> now she name drop. Magic oh, Mike. Right. Magic Pipe Mike. Shout yes, out to Magic Pipe Mike. Like, you know, you in the that, comments, like, like, no, like I was I was never I was in a version when I met him, but he like he laid it down good. And so like we holding hands, we cuddling, like we going to fucking Walmart. <laughs> That's big. <laughs> that was big. So going to That's Walmart big. was big to you. That was big to me at that time. That was big. Like we going to Walmart. Okay. Oh, okay. Cool. Okay. Okay. So, I told him like, you know, like we should start dating. Like, you know, what I'm saying we sh- we we should start dating. And he was like, date? Nah, we just fucking like. When I said, oh, I had a nigga hit me with that too. I ain't gonna hold you. I it wasn't the, it it wasn't that I had a nigga hit me with that though that the we just dating I ain't gonna hold you and that month that he shit hurt he that said, shit hurt my feelings and he cause he, we had a connection like we we were just fucking we had a connection like we were like you thought, hey, you I thought, thought, you. I you thought, thought we y'all did. had a connection I thought we did but he was just he was like I don't believe in relationships but why wouldn't you respect for like. Why wouldn't you just respect for a man? Wouldn't you, wouldn't you rather a nigga tell you that up front? Yeah, but he didn't send me a friend. He didn't send me a friend. Because he made it seem like, because his actions didn't go with his words. Like, you saying? Because I'm cool. Because it, it was just fucking, okay, we could just fucking out this go home. But we laid up. We, you know what I'm saying? We going out and shit. You know what I'm saying? So... I felt like, because he was, he was older than me, so I felt like in a sense he was manipulating my, like, he was. But you fucked your head after that. No, I didn't, because he gave me something. Oh, shit. Mm. On that note, y'all make sure y'all like, comment, share, share, and subscribe. subscribe. And hit that bean. And hit and that, that bean. And shout out to our littles. And shout out to our aces. Because what? We the who's who around this thing. Hey, you talking about? All right. But, um, no, I had to double it. No, we had to double it. And bring it back. Let's get into it. Like, no, nah, because it's real conversation. Like, for real, for real. And if you're not protecting yourself, stay protected. But, like, real, real, be real, honest. real talk, real talk. So, like, you've already been honest enough. Like, how was it? Like, how did you feel when you found out a nigga burnt you? Oh, uh, disgusting! I felt like. And how, how did you? How did you find out? I found out. I went, like I said, around this time. Now, around this time, I went to college in St. Louis. I went to St. Louis University for college. Mm-hmm. All right. So, um, I think we had to do blood tests for something. And so, they got us blood tests. But I was high. I was like, I ain't got shit. You know what I'm saying? Cause I, when I do fuck, like, even if I'm not in a relationship, I fuck one person. Mm-hmm. You know, because I don't believe in, like, fucking multiple niggas. Yeah, know? and I, I wonder if that's all cancers. Or is that or, or is no, it's just a special type of cancer? No, I just, I don't, I don't, it's nasty to me. You know what I'm saying? It's just, I mean, I'm not just a dude, you know what I'm Do your thing with a dude, but I just believe fucking It just ain't never been here. And so, um, the, the results, the results came back and she, it was like, oh, we got chlamydia. And I was like, wait. So, call him. What was your, okay, boom. What was your call conversation? Him. I was him. like, hey, um, you, I got my blood, I was basically told him, like, hey, I got my blood test the results back in. They tell me I got, uh, you know, some shit. Then the nigga tried to put it on you. He was you like, oh, you didn't get it from me. I'm like, but you're the only person I've been with. Right, you know what I'm saying. So we had to come from you. He was like, "Oh well." That's where I kind of lost all my respect for him, and just completely just yeah, no, no, nothing. He was just like, so did that moment make you move safer? Mm-hmm. Absolutely. Like, so, cause to be honest, like now it was moments where, like after that, I did slip up a few times, but like. I was real precautious on like protecting my. Like, I'm gonna start off as condom sex. I'm gonna always start off that way. But it like, but you, realistically, you're not I'm, gonna. Keep I don't like condom, condom sex. sex. Like I, it I just, I don't like so condom good. sex. Uh, I be, I be feeling like sometimes, like, am I addicted to latex or something? Like, I feel like latex stink. But I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm definitely gonna start off that way because you, I know, like, I feel like, despite the. Stereotypes, niggas is more nasty. 
more and nasty. Like, like I bitches. said, they fuck anything. And the nigga is more prone to burn a bitch before a bitch burn a nigga. Right. Absolutely. It's and rare. And the is more prone to hide that shit before a bitch. Like, I feel like bitches will tell a nigga before a nigga will tell a bitch. Absolutely. Like, like dead ass. And the thing, the crazy part about it, I'm like, I, it still like remain in my head. Like, did you have this way before? Did you just have this shit after? Like, cause even though it was a quick fix, we was just like, damn, like, really? That's that's crazy. Like, I, I wasn't fucking with that man. I wasn't. I, I feel I, I, it's yeah, crazy. I you know. actually, you could rebirth the memory in my mind. Like I was really sitting there, like, damn. Somebody like, in the comments said all niggas not like that. No, not all niggas are like that. Not all niggas are like that. No, you know what I'm saying? Like my dude, like I, he, he honest. Like I could respect niggas. Be like, yeah, man, I was out here doing the streets. Da, da, da. Okay, next step, let's get tested. That's ever since him. We going to the clinic, baby. I'm you're doing that test. I'm doing this test. And by the time the results show, okay, now we can fuck. Cause like, if I get something, but after that, oh, I know you meant fucking somebody else. So we already took this test when we first met. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like I think it should be uh, you know offended by that because especially here, these niggas they fucking niggas too. So but it's just I like, did see I did see a recent list. Of like the spike of STDs and Atlanta has came down a little bit. I think we went from like number three to like six or seven. Still in the top ten, but Atlanta has came down a little bit. But you gotta like even that like still in the top ten, especially now. Especially but nah, now. one thing about these niggas around here, and I know for sure. I bro, like I, can't I just speak for no other niggas. The truth. You are these niggas around shit. here do not give a fuck. You could tell a nigga you got something. They don't care. They don't care. I promise you. They don't care. Sure don't. You can tell a nigga. Yo, coochie can stink. That shit hurts. <laughs> they still hit. My stomach just started hurting. Did, because you know, because you know it ain't gonna lie. Thoughts. Kelly Cash. Stay safe. Stay safe. Stay safe. Stay safe, get tested. These games, they, they, the two niggas is out here playing, and it's real dangerous. Like, and it's, and and it's I, fucked up. No, really, like, you know, honestly, what really went through my mind, I'm like, well, this shit could have been something else. You know how many bitches fuck one time, or just any nigga, just pick the wrong nigga. But that goes back get, to that bi shit. That goes back to that bi shit. Like, fucking with a motherfucker that's bi. Like, I'm already worried about a nigga fucking a thousand bitches. Right. So I gotta worry about a nigga fucking a thousand bitches and a thousand niggas too. Yeah. For so, sure. no, I couldn't fuck with a nigga that's bad. Give me the lowest, give me the lowest odds. Like, that's just doubling my, double it. That's just doubling my odds to fuck with a bad nigga. Mm, for real. But then again... You could be fucking with a body nigga all along and not even fucking know it. Facts. I think I did. I think that's my sexual I'm telling you. Yeah. Anybody put a finger in your ass, you just... It did. Yeah, let you... Ass. Like... What the fuck remotely makes you put your finger in a nigga ass? Because I already have my theories. Okay, okay. I already have my theories. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. And we definitely finna get to that. Boom. Do you know, okay, what niggas do you try like that? Like, do you know the in your, ones I know do I you try? know in your head? Okay, My nigga, I can't do that. What qualities of a nigga that, like, like, you, you got a little roster? You feel me? I mean, just you know, one nigga, you know, that you know, punch me because the face. reason I knew to try him like that, you know, being a shower, I, you know what I'm saying? Like, kind of act like I watched his ass a little bragging and so. You know, get twin. Are like, you mischievous with it? Yeah, and, and he's so he's he spread. Like, hmm. That's how you know. So he's like the spread. So the nigga spread. The thing is, I've been with niggas. Hold on, pause, I tried. Pause, 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 pause. Hold on, we pause. <laughs> if you was taking a shower with no. a nigga and you was bathing no. a nigga, no. no, ain't no. It's not even a yes or no question. You bathing a nigga because. I ain't gonna hold you. 
I like to be in the shower. Like and baby, my spread his ass cheek is gay. If He's a gay. nigga spread his cheeks on you, and you, this is just yeah, wash down here, baby. What the Make fuck sure is you get down what here. the fuck is you gonna right do? Here. What is you gonna do if a nigga spread his cheeks? You're gonna get out. You're gay. <laughs> I get no way. Y'all gonna talk about this? We're not talking about shit. We ain't talking about shit. We ain't got shit to talk about. I'm on the phone. Fuck you, sister. Sister. This thing that's This thing that's crazy. It was literally the same day I did this. She would wake me up on my sleep. I would. On some shit. I could be not. No, bitch. Get the fuck up. No. Now. 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 Get up. Okay, so when a nigga spread his cheeks on you, like back to the. What? What the, that, that my mind? Mean, yeah. What goes through your mind? I was mind? like, this nigga like this shit. Like this. So now I'm gonna try some more. So I was and like, then you be let's, having on nails and shit. I have okay. nails on this time. But <laughs> so we on a bed, do our little thing. Now, first of all, okay, I was you know sixty nine, right? You were sixty nine. Uh-huh. I was you still gonna so I said, hmm, let me put my finger see if you know what I'm saying he like this shit. That nigga bust his leg wide open like this. Bumbling. He told her, he told her he was like this. Was, t- so I you was got, like, you don't don't like this shit. Basketball player ass nigga legs, legs, legs up. I'm talking about I uh, flexible. He showed me his little flexibles. And meaning his <laughs> legs done been up a fuck. Exactly. So So you don't have a problem with that. Yes, I do. I ain't fuck with that nigga no more. After after but, that, I never I never mess with that man ever again. Cause we just like I cannot be it, with it. But you turned his ass out that night. No, you been turned out, baby. Them, them figures went no, straight no, in I'm there. saying, but in in y'all situation, after you figured that out, you turned that ass out that night, and you never called that nigga again. Exactly, is what I'm saying. And he probably did. So that shit funny. Turning the nigga out. <laughs> Basically, I'm pleased. Turning man. a nigga out is fun to you. I not even just I was just, already turned out. His booty cheeks was already spread it, bitch. Bust so, wide open. So did your finger spread go in easily? Like he's already being fondled. Bitch, contact clues. Oh, I said that. I said that nigga was already turned out. <laughs> You niggas out here. It, this, this is this is interesting. But yeah. I know who to try. I, you know niggas who you not finna go in and fucking put a finger on your nigga ass. You're not doing that. You know you finna get your shit. See, I think if I wanted to see if a nigga, if you that really way, get a black eye, I ain't gonna hold you. I'm gonna offer the nigga a three way and I'm gonna call you. Yep. Yeah. I'm gonna offer the, and I'm be like, so try the nigga out. Like dead ass. Actually, I got home. We can go through the motherfucking house. No, you know what's crazy? But though? I want to see. Look, I got a homegirl that literally can pay to <coughs> see these niggas is gay. No. Or pet to, niggas. Or pet niggas. She get a massage and shit and she start laminating. Could you peg a nigga, sis? I'm not doing that shit. <laughs> I'm sorry. Like you, like you, you know, your face or your face is nothing near booty, but. If it, if you know, what, could you peg a nigga? Can I do what is that? Peg so basically, like strap a nigga. You put a strap on. No. And you fucking that nigga. You. Mm. Cancer is on so. Yeah, I'm not fucking no niggas. Me are, but I'm not fucking. Now that's something I cannot do. I'm sorry, I'm not finna. Okay, but yeah, could you strap a girl? No, I can't do that either. I ate a girl, but I never really liked. So you can't, you can't strap. Yeah, that's, that's too in chunks. Now, now I do have nigga legs. The but. thing, the thing about the thing about strap-ons to me, and this is oh, so, no, this strap-ons. is so random. <laughs> because I've seen like videos and shit. I just don't get the purpose of it. It's funny <laughs> to me how your booty cheeks hang got the motherfucking straps <laughs> in the back, so I can never take it serious. Like even <laughs> it, it, like, I can, because I'm gonna think about. Your cheeks ain't like I don't know if it be too no, tight. Know it be I don't know me. if it be too tight it around be, the this thighs. Be I'm gonna tell you one thing. <laughs> on them pornos, them studs be having no boxes. Like, bro, I be seeing the naked ones and they and then the, the studs ass be fat. It's and so it, it be, be like hard. fat oh, ass. Yeah, bitch, you got yeah, fat like, ass. Yeah, like it be fat ass, 
coming out the back of the motherfucking strap and shit. So it's just like I, I'm gonna end up giggling. Like, let me smack your ass, bitch. Like, I mean. <laughs> Oh, shit. I'm okay for like, it. I'm right. I'm gonna end up just giggling and shit, but I've never like. I'm I don't shit. understand why certain men like that shit. Like, I, you know, I'm saying like the best motherfucker. By all means, I'm not judging you. Shit, that's what you're just like. But I can't be with you, bitch. I'm sorry. And I wouldn't dare try my nigga like that. Fuck, I'll definitely get punched. Like, you know who to try. I know who to try. I'm not trying my nigga like that. I'm sorry. Mm-mm. I even told him the story. He was like, "What? Oh, man, I will never. Oh, man, fuck no. I actually did try to try me. What was you doing? Like, he wanted you to try him? No, I just, I just want to make sure, be sure that he would not want to do that. Uh, he was on the side. You know how you do it in. You gonna get see. punched in the motherfucking face? He was like, he literally pressed it. He was like, "Girl, what the fuck was you?" I was like. Sorry, See, <laughs> so you're going to be one of the first 48 stories. <laughs> What's the <laughs> caption, sis? What's the caption, sis? Her last try. Her <laughs> 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 last day. Her right, last try. <laughs> Man, you go, you go, don't end up on first 48 trying these niggas to own no I sexual function. I would have to be sure, yourself. bitch. You know what? I had to make sure. You got to make sure. You might try tonight. <laughs> don't I will it. not. You... I don't know. Bet the fuck oh, not. you you most definitely you most definitely mm-hmm. don't have to worry about man. I will not nip nip. I I'm not even trying a nigga that's not mine. Like I I don't I, I don't think I don't think. But I ain't gonna hold you. I pop up with two black eyes like uh, Krishan did blueface. You know what? I'm not playing <gasps> oh, with you. Oh my god! I'm not playing with you. I feel uncomfortable even if like the dick getting good and missionary style mm-hmm. and I'm going down your back. Once I feel I'm coming up that arch, I feel uncomfortable right there and I stop. Like or I yeah. I'll be like, I put my hands on the bed or something. You feel nah I ain't gonna say sometimes I ain't gonna sometimes I be wanting to smack your ass like y'all want to, like sometimes, but I never do it, never try it. I like my teeth. But I'm just saying oh, like, I'm just saying like I don't yeah. I don't think like I can't even try. I can't even try my nigga on no joke and shit like that. Like, hey, good job, pal. Like, nigga, I'm be like, bitch. Yeah, like, <laughs> well, I don't even call you cry. bitch, but bitch, like, <laughs> no, don't do that. I don't know. That's just you. That's some. That that's some. That's some freaky shit. Yeah, it is. Like, that's you. The ultimate freaking ain't never got your motherfucking leg back. I, I'm still appalled about that, but. You one of the good ones, so I I, I, I told C I you. Yeah, see, I most I most definitely applaud you. Yeah. But um, yeah. Tonight's yeah, episode yeah. has been freaked out. You get what I'm saying? And you already know what's going on. Nah, bitch, we're not done. Because what's the freakiest thing you done, y'all? I, I, I know she she done some some shit. I know. Oh. What's the freakiest thing you have done? That's what or bitch. <laughs> I never I, I'm low that. level freak. I'm basic level freak. I'm I'm regular freak shit. You get what I'm saying? Like I think the freakiest shit I've ever done is probably just hell in head went down to the balls. That's probably it's it's I'm boring freak. It. You get what I'm saying? I'm, I'm I'm basic freak. You get what I'm saying? I might swallow one at a time. You know what I'm saying? But that's like you know, but it's hard to do swallow. But I ain't gonna hold you now. Like one of one of my searches, and you know, in in my porn hub search because we had like a a conversation like last episode, like what's in your porn hub search? Mm-hmm. So one of my one of my searches, I ain't gonna flex. So I put it out there. Be facials. Nobody have I ever had a facial? No, never have. Push your fans. But that's what that's in my search. So I was talking to my nigga one day, and we was just like, and we had got on that, and I was like, you ever need to be like that? And he was like, mm, yeah. I was like, so he was like, I said so, just jokingly. I was like, <laughs> give me a facial. And he was like, but hell no. Now mind, I was really joking. But I wanted to see what he was going to say. Because, like, 
You claim you done ran trains up with your brother and got them. Like, so I want to know what it's like. Blase, right. blase, like, what, what goes through a, a man's head? And he gave me the perfect answer. He was like, hey, that's like, he said, I could never do, like, that type of shit with you. Now, mind you, pause in the story. I'm like, that type of shit with you and nigga, you be having me th- on the roof in this motherfucker, but neither here nor there. But he was like, because he was like, I can't slut out my wife. Like, I can't slut out my girlfriend. So I'm like, so what is, like, slutting out? You get what I'm saying? But how you described everything, nothing is slutted out. Like, some people, it's just, some people, it's just like, what you like is what you like. It's like, mm-hmm. you're a freak. But, no, nah, I ain't never, I ain't, not, so back to the moral at hand. I ain't never been slutted out. Like, okay. so, you know, I'm, I feel so like this if you feel me like now mind you I could like I do my thing like you just not fucking me put it like that you not fuck you just not fucking me now it's time but I just want to get fucked but you mm-hmm. just not fucking me baby like period I'm gonna put you on your back I'm gonna put you down yeah but yeah I I don't like ain't no you know I've had yeah. some wild crazy shit happen to me. But me doing it, Mm-mm. and the wildest thing I've ever happened to me I that I didn't enjoy out. was a nigga put me in that finger four shit and was trying to hit me from the back, and I'm like, nigga, I don't my arms is up and shit. I'm like, wait a minute, y'all niggas have like too funny. many rap about? songs and shit. I don't enjoy you said this was and on shit. Your, your hand. Okay, it, no, is it the finger four or the? Or I don't the, know. I'm whatever. Trying to learn. Like, so I can try it. This shit. It's a wrestling move. Turn around. What's this? This shit right here. Okay. I forgot what this. Wait, look at him. Look at him up. Okay, I forgot what this. But it's like the fighting move. Like, but yeah. yeah. But yeah. Oh, so I like that. Like, no, no. That's, that's like that. Cool. That's like cool. I like that. shit. And you fuck around and bump your head Ooh, one time. Yeah. Yeah. I don't even yeah. want to do it no more. It's so fun. I don't even want to do it no more. So, whatever that move is. Maybe this. Niggas, maybe maybe you move. prefer like this. Maybe for her. This ain't even general. It's not even bitches who like that. She likes that. I like that's that. That's not one move I that's attracted it. to us. Mm-hmm. So she ever been in that move? Oh, oh yeah. So you shot I've been in that move like one yeah. time. I forgot what it's called, but I've been in that move one time. Mm-hmm. What's that your favorite like sex one. position? From the back. Okay. All the above. Front, side, back, bent over. <laughs> Yeah, now it's something about a female taking control from the back. That be it for me. Like I'm being the move, but back. It depends bow, on where bow. you at with that girth. From the back, gonna always get you in that. You don't be on little, that liquor. Even if you're a little dick nigga, you can make from the back feel good. Yeah, yeah. That's probably the only position. But. I ain't had too many little dick niggas either. Mm. And I had one in two. One in two. And, and on that note, we're going to take a toast to the Christmas season, the New Year season, and everything else coming up because we finna start getting our ugly niggas in. Oh, man. That's not how I want to end my holiday season. So. Shout out to the squad, shout out to the crew, shout out to the mall, shout out to We Good Media, shout mm-hmm. out to We Good Podcast, shout out to my boy Q. Q. You already know what the fuck going on. This is the week. No, it's not. It's not the week. It, matter of fact, this is still the week because motherfucker, we always good in this thing, but y'all already know this is the Keeping It 100 talk show, aka the realest podcast out this thing you already know shout out to zeus you see us too you yeah, feel me we'll get you to a to be continued because we got to talk about that blue face shit and all that Ooh. but um yeah we'll get yeah we got y'all but zeus you see us yeah, y'all ain't like what y'all want us to do fire her ass up one time you feel me to show y'all like this is what we do we be saying sure. like, what? hold on like, like oh, what's up <laughs> <Wait, man. laughs> <laughs> but now shout out to reach Shout out to Diddy. Shout out to Revolt already. It's your girl, Kylie Cash. You have to cash it with a K because I like it my way all day, every day, baby, baby. I got to go make some money. I love y'all. Y'all be safe. And it's your girl, Southside 100. The name without a flavor. 
and it's made it, it my air. 